Hi there, it's me again. Um, I wanted to share with you about when you're adapting exercise to for people with muscle disease and adapting fitness um, to you. I wanted to share with you a trick that I use, which um, is funny, I call it adapt. Okay, and here's like how it starts. So, A, you have A is for accessibility. I don't even know how to spell that. Um, A for accessibility. And basically, um, what that means is when you're looking at exercises, you want to do something, um, you want to find something, like, as you're looking through them, you want to be thinking, is this something that I can do? Is this accessible for me? Or do I need to adapt it? Um, so like, for example, I can't do lunges. So if I'm looking at, at someone and their basic exercise move starts with a lunge, then that's not really going to be accessible for me. But, but maybe there's some way that I can adapt it. But I might want to look for other options that might be more accessible to me. Okay, and then second, in ADAPT we have the D, which is uh, leads me to my next thing. Is it doable? Hmm. Is it doable? So if you're looking at exercises, um, is it something that's doable for you? So for example... Um, I discovered the other day I can't do a lunge off of the ground and get all on my knees and stand back up. However, I can do it off the trampoline, so it would be doable. It would be hard, extremely hard for me, but it is doable. Um, so that's something else to keep in mind as you're searching through exercises to do. And then next, you have apply. Okay, I don't know what I was thinking when I did that. Um, I feel like this is a little bit out of order, but if you do see an exercise that, yes, you think it is accessible and you think it is doable, then go ahead and apply it in your exercise routine. And does it work for you without getting hurt? Um, are you able to apply it in other things? Um, for example, if it's like reaching over your head, are you able to apply it? Does it help with like putting your clothes on or something? I don't know. Um, you know, just something like that. Does it apply to you? Will it be beneficial to you? And is it helpful to you? Okay, moving on, the P. I like this one. This is my favorite. It is for physical. Oh my goodness, physical limitations. All right, physical limitations. So, <clears throat> if you are like me and you're someone with a muscle disease recognize that you do have physical limitations you aren't going to be able to do everything and it might take quite a bit before you find um like an exercise that you can even adapt to you because you have to build up that strength before you can do it so just recognize that physical limitations do exist don't beat yourself up over it it's okay when <laughs> that happens and um just know to, to keep going all right, and then the last one, the T, I like also stands for a try. Once you find an exercise that you like, um, you think it's accessible, you think it is doable if you find a way to adapt it and you've applied the adaptation, you recognize that you do have a physical limitation that it's not going to hurt you to do it, um, then just try it. See how it goes for you. Be very careful if you're trying something new. Don't hurt yourself. Um, and 
Um, this is what I do for myself. I am not a physical therapist or any way, any medical not have any medical knowledge in what in any way whatsoever other than for me. So it is a good idea to check with a physical therapist or another medical professional um, before trying this. But or before, like if you find one and then you adapt it to you and then you before you try it, it's always a good idea to check with a professional and so you don't hurt yourself. But anyway, so that's what I do when I'm looking for um, work exercises to try and gain strength. I see how accessible it is first. I, I tend to try it out and see if it's doable for me. If it's not, I adapt it and apply my adaptations to it. Um, I do, I always recognize that I have physical limitations. Sometimes this honestly can be the hardest part because you really want to do that one thing and when you can't, it it can just be tough and hard. Um, but anyway, recognizing that you have physical limitations and not beating yourself up over it if it's something that you can't do. And then trying out, uh, trying it out with your adaptations that you made. Anyway, so that is my acronym ADAPT. And hopefully this helps you out. Um, if so, Please keep following me. I plan to share more of my tips with you and how I adapt exercise for people with, uh, well, for me in particular, but how this could also be applied for people with muscle disease um, or anyone else struggling with fitness. And so don't forget to hit that um, subscribe button and keep an eye out for my next video. Have a great one, you all.